Um, Mr. Trump, with the exception of your family, oh, it's about have Donald you ever Trump. been told no? I love Donald Trump. Oh, many times. I started off in Brooklyn. My father gave me a, a small, small loan of a million dollars. Wait, a small and loan? A million dollars isn't very much compared to what I've built. It hasn't been easy for me, but I'm filthy rich. We have very stupid people in our country negotiating for us, and we have leaders that don't know what they're doing. Like yourself? He's talking about himself. $505 billion. We're gonna lose that. 505 billion. And by the way, I don't like this mic. No, this mic is terrible. This stupid mic keeps popping. Why are you talking about a microphone? He's like a five year old. He throws tantrums about like stupid things. You are the and I'll, single and I'll biggest tell you. liar. This guy will say anything. You will too. Nasty guy. Now I know why he doesn't have one endorsement from any right. of his colleagues. All right, just, just, so just, undiplomatic. When you point to his own record, he screams liar, liar, liar. If you want to go Where did I support it? Where did I support it? If you want to go Hey, Ted, why? where did I support it? It's kind of like me and my brother. Let Donald Trump talk for once, yeesh. They're both like the rare half fries of Beverly Hills. Somebody should run against John McCain. I supported him. He lost. He let us down. So I never liked him as much after that, because I don't like losers. <laughs> Oh my God. Frank, Frank, so you Frank shouldn't like yourself he then. He hit me. He's not a war hero. He's a war hero because he was captured. I like people that weren't captured, okay? I hate to tell you. Oh my God. That's so mean. You don't really joke about that kind of stuff. It's really serious. One of the things people love about you is you speak your mind and you don't use a politician's filter. You've called women you don't like fat pigs, dogs, slobs, and disgusting animals. <laughs> Your Twitter account Only is Rosie several... O'Donnell. That is so rude. He speaks his mind, but his mind isn't right. Classic Trump. Our country has tremendous potential. Let's make America great again. Still is great. And you're just gonna make it worse. I don't want him for president. If he becomes president, I'm moving to Canada. He's on the news, he's on Vine, he's on social media, he's on everything. A lot of people have comb-overs, but that comber, comb-over, like, you have to know. So from watching these clips, what do you think of this guy? He's funny, he's a nice guy, but the other people that are rude to him, they don't let him talk. I think he's a horrible person, no offense. A lot of people like him only because he says things that other people don't have the courage to say. But sometimes you just gotta keep some certain things in. One of the women said like he didn't have that politician filter and he just says whatever he feels like saying. If he's gonna be rude to ladies, he shouldn't be a president. Why do you think people like him? Probably because they think he's smart. The people on the news were saying that he was like feeding into people's fears. My parents like him because they say he speaks his mind, but I hate him. Well, some people are saying that they like that he speaks his mind, that so many people that run for president always just say what everyone wants them to say. I think it is not right to do. I think it isn't that nice as a president because presidents are supposed to be nice. You have to appear confident, but I like it when people are humble at the same time. He speaks his mind and doesn't really care what people think, but sometimes the thing that's not presidential is what's on his mind. Trump has said that if he's elected president, he's going to do things like create jobs and protect our country, but he's also proposed doing things like placing a ban on people from the Muslim religion from entering the United States until we can figure out the terrorist problem and building a wall between the U.S. and Mexico to keep out illegal immigrants. That's stupid. My friend has a brother that lives in Mes Mexico, so if, they, if he puts a wall, they won't be able to come over here. It is a free country. You're just taking that away. There are Muslims in the world who, you know, hate what's happening and wish that they could stop it. To just like ban all of them would be a little extreme. Mexicans coming into the U.S. without, a, um, without having to do anything when uh, my parents coming from Italy and having to do all this stuff when they don't have to. I mean, that's stupid. Some of his ideas are not the worst, but most of them are. He should not be president. Do you care who the next president is gonna be? Well, as long as it's not Donald, I'm fine. It does not affect my life whatsoever, and I only care about sports. Who rules our country is gonna affect us because we're pretty much the next generation, and we're gonna have the country next. It matters a lot. Because the president can remove laws, he can make new laws. I don't really care because I trust, well, I somewhat trust the adults. There are people that 
think that he shouldn't be running for president because they think he isn't qualified. He had his own board game once. And he also has been like on WWE. He's, he wrestled? But his supporters think that that's the type of person the country needs, that they need someone that is more like everyone else. Everyone had a job before coming president. I like people with a different background, but I also want someone who's more into politics. You need experience to become president. If you have no experience, something's gonna go wrong. Well, difference is good. It's just maybe a different type of different. Do you think Donald Trump is gonna become the president? Da, 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 no. 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 I don't think he'll win. Fingers crossed he's not. <sighs> no. No. Or at least I'm hoping. I pray to God, no. Donald Trump will not be our next president. Yes, but I don't think he should. Everyone in my house is guaranteeing it, so I have to. Might, but there's no telling. I mean, anything could happen.